Finally, Moti versus is dead. Let's let him know who really got it. Came up from the bottom. Now we riding in a mozzie. And these my jealous done burnt to hold in my pocket. See me, I'm shining. Now, before you watch this video, go to uh, Multiverse's Twitter and watch their video that they just did. And then after that, come back to this video and, you know, finish watching it. But for those that already, you know, watch this video, let's get straight into it. So, pretty much, if you hear the news, Multiverse's it will be closing their open beta. I have to say this because people don't understand that this game is in beta. Open beta in um, on June um, 25th, and they'll be relaunching the game fully in 2024 and i know a lot of people are probably asking bugsy what, what are your thoughts man like you've been pushing and grinding this game so hard like how do you feel about this game going down um now after being open for nearly eight months almost to a year and i'm honestly happy <laughs> i feel relieved i felt like when i when i grind games and, and i go into competitive i put my all into it the bare minimum i put into a games are 90 percent. so that other 10 percent is like you know doing other stuff but 90 percent of my time is putting to this game so once i felt like the game wasn't worth it anymore i kind of was like 50 50 ing stuff you know i was doing this and doing that still trying to get into the game still trying to lean away from the game for now until it got better and this kind of just left leave lifts the weight off my shoulders it's like okay i don't have to care for this game for the whole rest of the year let me go focus on other things, improve on a lot of other things, and then I could come back to this game next year and see how it is and see how the future for this game is. And I'm going to be honest with you, I have so much faith in this game still, and I know a lot of people are saying, how do you have faith in this game after all we just experienced, after we all just went through? It was open beta, but... Time out. Didn't you just hear what you just said? Open beta. I know it's open beta, but Fortnite and the... Fortnite? This, this is not Fortnite. But I know, but I know, but Smite, Smite, this ain't Smite. This is a indie team that got a big project acceptance by Warner Brothers to do something like this. Their first time doing a fighting game. Yes. Did they drop the ball on this? 1000%. I'm not arguing and denying it 100%. This game could have been 10 times better on release. But definitely on the business side is what kind of dwelled down on this game. Because I'm going to be honest with you, this game was not ready at all. This game was forced because of EVO and whatever other reasons and intertwined that PFG and WB had, but this game was not ready. And for those of y'all that think PFG don't care about multiverses, y'all are fucking lunatics. You see that video? My boy Tony looks tired of sh as shit. He looks like he's been working and grinding on that game for fucking hours on hours. I don't think you understand that these devs truly do care. It is hard to cater to a big community that we had. Yeah, it's smaller now, but at the same time, there are people that still want to get back into the game. But they just, again, they just know when to back off and wait for something to be ready. And as you can see, it is not ready. But don't sit here and say these devs don't care. They have to cater to competitive, casual, business side, all that and being a small team all these other games that y'all want to talk about in beta fortnite smite and all these other games bro those motherfuckers had hundreds two hundreds thousands of fucking devs on the game bro pfg is like a 15 to 20 man fucking team and i know a lot of people probably saying is why don't you just hire more devs bro they probably are or trying but sometimes we don't know what's going on in the business side so it's probably taking time to build a nice and developed team they probably don't want to just hire anybody they want to hire people that actually care for the game that wants to make better for the game and actually have experience or etc whatever the case the reason but bro they are a small team hopefully in 2024 they have a bigger team a solid team that is intertwined with the game love the game and have a game plan completely ready because i'm not gonna lie i'm also gonna have a future video explaining what i want to see in the future and i would love to hear y'all feedback and thoughts on that too because i want to make a big like list for pfg i guess from the community that still loves the game and stuff and say hey guys y'all have this much time we will love to see this see so here's this list that the community will love to see like like pretty much i will go through the the comments and say what has been said multiple times and try to make a list of that like hey this is what the community will really 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 love to see in the game all right guys i don't want to make this video too long so i'm going to finish this off with the next three part um pointers number one look at this video views bro one million this video has only been out for an hour and it has a million views already that is crazy for a dead game with less than a thousand people on steam charts remember because people keep forgetting that there's numbers on console but you know obviously you can't see it but i'm telling you console has more numbers but anyways a million views guys people still have interest into this game it's just sad to say that the game doesn't 
work properly that is why people aren't playing it but people are still watching it and trying to see when it's gonna come back trust me right number two i know a lot of people are sad that the game is closing on june 25th don't worry you can still play the game offline so if you have the game downloaded you can still play the game offline i know a lot of people are saying that oh i have no one around me in my area to play with don't worry if you are on pc um there's this thing called parsec it's pretty much like a remote play it's a software that allows you to play with people around the world online yeah some will have input delay and stuff but if you are decently close within like one or two states and not too far i would say if you could get less than 30 ms with somebody then the game will feel like offline obviously anything higher it will kind of feel like a delay but if you live pretty close like i said if your connection between the person is less than 30 ms then you have a fun time i'm gonna make a video about that in the future again when the time gets a little bit closer probably make it early just for the people that want to start practicing now um with their friends you know because the, the game just you know be completely different <laughs> but yeah and then finally bugsy where are you going to be going well right now i'm just going to be focusing on myself irl stuff but i am not going to stop streaming and i'm not going to stop doing youtubing i'm going to be moving over to valorant yeah if you haven't noticed i've been playing valorant again i've been going back to my shooting game ways and i think that is where i'm going to stay until uh multiverses come back in 2024 sorry guys i'm not really a big fighting person um i'm definitely gonna try out the project l game um you know rye games game and i think that's the only other fighting game that I might give it a try i might give street fighter 6 a try maybe but that's about it so if you do still want to see me and support me i will be over in valorant also we try to be competing in the next act because they have something called premiere where you can do in-game tournaments which i think is dope and a great way to get into a game like that and yeah guys that's it for the video multiverses is dead but it will come back in the future. Leave a like if you like the video. Comment about anything. Comment about your thoughts, man. You already know I love talking to the community and talking back to y'all. And it's the first time everyone watching one of my videos and you did enjoy, hit the subscribe button, guys, and I'm out. Peace. Yeah, she got a man, she don't really give a fuck about Left him back home in a whole nother state. Moved to LA cause she wanna be famous. Got another five on the side, she a waitress. But it's getting tough. Hard to find out.